The Central Bank of Kenya is set to undergo radical transformation if the draft Central Bank of Kenya Bill 2014 is passed in its current form. The bill seeks to repeal the Central Bank of Kenya Act and to enact a new legislation that will formulate and implement monetary policy, promotion of price stability and issuance of currency. The draft bill, which was published today, also gives the bank powers to provide for capital, reserves and profit allocation in the regulation of the financial sector in Kenya. The bill loosens National Treasury's tight grip on the bank and transfers the same to the planned Central Bank of Kenya Board of Directors. Under the proposed law, the Cabinet Secretary will lose power to appoint the Governor and his or her two deputies, a role that will be reserved to the Board of Directors. The draft bill further seeks to stamp the autonomy of Central Bank of Kenya by declaring that it shall not be under the direction or control of any person, agency or any other authority in the exercise of its powers or in the performance of its functions. CBK will be required to establish a general reserve fund which will retain a cash reserve of not less than 20 billion shillings. The bill tasks CBK as a banker to both the national and county government as well as provide economic and financial advice to the government of Kenya. CBK will also act as a fiscal agent of the government and any other public entity. The draft bill requires CBK to submit to the National Assembly a monetary policy statement for the next 12 months which will specify the policies and the means by which the bank intends to achieve the policy targets. The National Treasury is calling for public and stakeholders' input before the bill is taken to Parliament for debate. O'Brien, Commander for Business Defined.